Hello, been a while. Uh, quick little update add on video before this all starts off properly. Uh, pick the camera up. That's Bruticus with the alternate arms. Um, I mean, the legs look properly skinny on him this way. Um, but yeah, I mean, this arm doesn't hold together at all. If you try to move the forearms, they just split. Uh, I think that arm's not as bad, but, you know. One thing I did notice, and this is mainly for the primary mode, because the way uh, F Firefly, or Blast Off as it is, transforms with his arms going over the shoulders, they end up being big lumps here. So you can only bring his arms to about there before they start catching on this. Now that wasn't an issue. Uh, that wasn't an issue on Defensor, because he didn't have these. They were around the back. That's just something for you to keep your eyes on. Now, let's throw this out the way. Uh, you know what, you're massive, you can stand on the floor. Uh, yeah, okay, on to uh, this video. Try and balance out the camera a bit. Let's go for... Ta-da! And the head is permanently slightly to one side. See that? Slightly looking that way. Okay, fair enough. Uh, this is, as with the uh, other diecast cars, which are these. This is diecast. And quite a lot. Apart from basically this black plastic. Effectively, in the wheels and you know, the rest of it, all this is metal. And the head's plastic. It's pretty heavy. Uh, size comparison. Can buy always drag strip, so it's you know roughly deluxe size. Uh, I think it's ever so slightly thinner. Yeah, ever so slightly thinner. You can't see because all the kibble and stuff, and, you know, all the weapons stuff. But yeah, he's slightly thinner. So. Let's go for the world's most simple transformation. Oh god, I've just had a thought. I hope he actually extends, but the Ferrari wouldn't do. Pretty sure this one will. We should be alright. Otherwise, I'm having another scrapped video, because... Oh god, that bloody thing. Uh... Hey! Did you hear everything rattling then? No? That's because I, I put a little bit too much pressure on it, and I over... I basically made the whole room shake. It's like, vroom. fall down the toes, bring out the arms, bring down the arms, but leave these little flaps, because they become basically like shoulder pads. Bend at the elbow if you really want to, and then you split this. Come on, why does that not want to do? Alright, okay, hold the head just in case. Fold, 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 down onto the chest, and then you can just bring the head up and clip it in. And, you know what, hang on, does that head turn? It might. No, I don't want to play with it, it's going to snap, isn't it? Yeah, there he is. This guy is clearly of the same kind of vibe as that one. Because he's, you know, a lot of the die cast and... But I don't know if it's because he's smaller or because his arms are slightly more usable. You know, that is... Friction on die cast doesn't really work that well, does it? But I don't know, there's something about this look. I'll flatten his toes out a bit better. Maybe it'll stand a bit nicer. But he's he's a nice little guy. Whereas these things are just abortions, especially, especially that one. Ugh. But no, he's a nice little guy. Um, he did come with, you know, the classic black, uh, sorry, gold chrome gun, which is rubbish and 
buried somewhere or lost the annals of time. They're, they're no good. They don't look. You can't store them anywhere, so who cares? But, no, he's, he's a nice little guy, you know. Compared to these things, he's just he's just a pleasant little guy. I've got no issues with him. I mean, all right, this nose completely covers up everything else, which is probably why uh, G1 Mirage was more one of those little indie guys with the snub nose, so that it would fit nicely onto the chest. But otherwise, he's not a terrible Gobot-esque Mirage knockoff. He's just a nice little guy. Uh, have I got anything remote mode to compare it to? Um, there we go. Combine all those pipes. No, you know, that'll do you. <laughs> do you care? You're never going to find this guy. Or if you do, you just think he's cute no matter what size he is. So, I'm going to leave this one there because uh, it's just a quick one. Um, to be honest with you, my selection of uh, knockoffs is completely dwindled. I've got a couple that I don't want to just throw away. And I've got a big set that I want to save for something special. Other than that, it's basically what I can find digging through crap, effectively. Um, if anyone knows where I can find knockoffs cheap in the UK without going online, or if anyone really wants to send them to me, please do so, because, like I say, I'm running out of knockoffs. And the sheer joy of new knockoffs is just fantastic. I actually went out today shopping to try and find some knockoffs. Very nearly ended up buying Combiner Wars Ultra Magnus. But then I saw my ex in a shop and just thought, yeah, no, drop. Boom, out the door. <laughs> so that was my exciting day. Anyway, I shall... Uh, just, I'm going to transform him back because it's quick and simple and it's fine. There you go. To victory! Da, 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 da. <laughs> I should be ugly, I should be wretched, and I shall see all of you in the next one.